peaceful, 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 peace. Next we have Sheikh Arif Islam from South Africa. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. When I arrived in uh, India, I arrived as a South African. When I leave India, I will leave as an Indian. There, there is so much that you have taught me. There is so much that I have learned from you. you, you I have taught you very little. You have taught me a lot. Humility, humbleness, how to serve. All those who have helped me have taught me how to serve others. So I have very little else to say other than thank you. And in South Africa we say bye donkey or yabonga for the help and all that you have taught me. Salam alaikum. Sheikh Jimmy Jones from USA. Bismillah wa hamdulillah wa salam wa salam wa ali rasulillah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. After praising Allah and thanking the organizers, Islamic Research Foundation, I would like to remind us, it is from the Sunnah of Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, that there's a sound hadith, the meaning of which is that this deen is nasiha, this deen is sound advice. I'd like to leave with you three pieces of advice. Number one for the Muslims, never ever be ashamed of being Muslim. Look at this crowd, never ever be ashamed of being Muslim. There are people out there who are trying to do that. Don't let them. To the non-Muslims who are here, never ever be afraid to take a good look at your deen and your sacred text. You might find out something important that you ought to know. And finally, PTFP. The Muslims, the Christians, and the Hindus together represent 4.5 billion people. If we pull together for peace, we'll have peace on earth. Walhamdulillah, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Dr. Ahmad Ibn Saifuddin from Saudi Arabia. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Alhamdulillah, alladhi bi ni'matihi tatimmu salihat. We have come to the completion of this great conference by the grace of Allah. We are thankful for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for this blessing. We are thankful to those organizers, to the volunteers, to the great speakers who came and gave their knowledge and shared it with the audience. But most importantly, to every one of you who made this a success by the grace of Allah. Let me say that we need to take a new step in our lives from this conference to the future. There is a saying of wisdom and has a true meaning. If your today is the same as tomorrow, if your tomorrow is the same as today, you are a loser. If your tomorrow is worse than today, then you are in failure. If your tomorrow is better than today, then you are a winner. We need all to be winners in the future. If every one of us would lead someone, some soul, to, sell, to save it from hellfire into Islam, we all be winners by the grace of Allah. Let's take this message. I greet you. I thank everyone. Indeed, India gave us its best in this conference. Thank you so much. May Allah bless you. May Allah give you reward for this generosity, hospitality, and humbleness that you have shown to all of us. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Brother James E. from USA. Of Guantanamo Bay fame. <laughs> Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Alhamdulillah rabbil alamin. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Wa alaikum assalam. Our beloved Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, Inna allaha yuhibbu idha amala ahadukum amalan an yutkinuhu. Our Prophet, peace be upon him, said, 
that Allah loves that when one from amongst you does something that he or she does it with excellence. I thank Dr. Zakir Naib, his entire coordinating committee and especially the hospitality committee and volunteers for living true to these words of our Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him. For with their effort and this conference they have performed with absolute excellence. I ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that he grant them, all of the speakers, all of the guests, and all of you a place in Jannah. Ameen, Ameen, Ameen. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. From James Yusuf Yee, the United States of America. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Brother Iqbal Sakrani from UK. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My respect to the elders and brothers and sisters, there are no words that can do justice in expressing our appreciation to our Creator, God Almighty, and to Dr. Zakir Naik and the Islamic Research Foundation for having this wonderful event, which Almighty Allah has blessed us with it. And I'm sure all of us present has gained knowledge, understanding about the, about the deen in a big way. My respected elders, this conference that we have seen today, I have had the opportunity to attend many such events. But facing such a crowd, one normally sees thousands and thousands of policemen to, to, to try and support and control the crowd. What amazes is there's such huge crowd present here. But with the grace of Allah, it has been conducted in such orderly manner without such presence of policemen or others. This really shows, this really shows that Almighty Allah has indeed accepted this event. And it is now for, for each one of us to take the message from here to wherever we are coming across, wherever we are going to, uh, to with a clear message that as a Muslim, we must remain optimist because it is the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that is going to prevail at all times. We are going to face immense challenges, challenges from the East and the West. But if we remain true to our faith, to the teaching of Islam, through the teaching of Quran, the Sunnah of the Prophet Wasallam, inshallah we shall be successful and move forward. May Allah protect us and guide all of us. Jazakumullah khair.